I did, along with um, Councilman um, Green, ask uh, request a reconsideration. I was approached by the applicant who was very concerned about the fact that there was what he felt was misinformation or misunderstood information. And uh, he wanted an opportunity to come back and uh, have his concerns addressed. Um, I really would like to see this happen for them. The Kai family has uh, been in the community for years and they've also been developing here for quite a few years. And um, because we are using Zoom to uh, communicate, sometimes there's, I believe there's a lot of lost communication that goes on that could have possibly contributed to the misunderstandings um, that they'd like to have uh, clarified. So for that reason, I would like to have this reconsideration considered and, um, and passed by council so that we can have them back and listen to their concerns. I think that we do about as well as you could possibly do with the Zoom format. But when you have people calling in and out alleging things that aren't true, and not giving the people that own the property and are trying to conform to our needs an opportunity to respond, I think the Zoom meeting falls short. And I guess I jo uh, would join uh, with Joyce Jones Ivy to give them another chance to come to respond to some of those things that were said. I mean, what I recall was the Greater Chamber was in favor the local chambers in favor. I walked and met with the merchants in the area who were in favor. The majority of people who called in until that last time when misinformation was being put out were in favor of it. So I'd like to give them another chance. I don't know that I would change my vote or that it might go another way, but I'd like to hear from them again. 